today we're going to install what is one of the cheapest interior mods that you can buy for your car onto my 8th gen Honda Civic. And that is these interior LED strip lights. Sorry, the lighting's kind of weird because I'm in the garage, but you get the idea. These go on the inside of your car and they can make cool colors and just really, really spice up the interior of your car. I got this for 15 bucks off Amazon, so super cheap. If you want to pick one of these up for yourself, I'll put an affiliate link in the description below if you want to buy one for yourself. Alright, so inside the box in here, you get everything you need for this. So you get four little LED strip lights that will plug in with the USB. The reason I went with the USB version instead of the one that goes into this cigarette letter here is because I already use that cigarette letter all the time for this little Bluetooth thing. And this already has um, some little USB ports in it. So I can just plug the lights straight into my existing USB ports on here. And that should work pretty good. So you get four lights in the package because you're supposed to, or I guess the idea with it is to put one in each of the foot wells there in the front seats and then one behind each of the front seats going towards the back seats. But as you can see, I don't really have functioning back seats and they're always down because I need more trunk space. So what I'm thinking is put one up front underneath by your feet up there and then put one underneath the seats right here for each of the front seats so that everything in the front is really lit up uh, and hopefully you won't be able to see the actual lights. So we're gonna try and install it like that. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Okay, I think we got them all in. You can see that one down there on the uh, the bar to adjust the seat right there. And then same thing, one, hang on, up there. And then the uh, seat adjustment bar there as well. So it's still obviously light outside. It's, it's I mean, it's 10 in the morning. Um, so we're just gonna give it a little test, see how it looks from in here. And then we'll test it again tonight when it's actually all dark. And then I'll show you guys what that looks like as well. So. Turn it on here. We have we have lights. We can change the color there. White, blue, purple, yellow, green. All the different colors. I probably use the blue a lot. Down here you can see that one there. And this one, it's not super bright right now, which is what I was expecting. This is a more of a nighttime thing. But you can actually still kind of see it. You can see it more than I was expecting for right now. So we can try out different colors. Man, it looks cool. I'm really happy with this so far. I really like how this is looking. All right, now the only thing I wanna do with this yet, uh, besides testing it later on tonight, is just to kind of just clean them all the cables a little bit, because as you can see, there's a lot of, a lot of cableage everywhere. So I'm gonna grab some duct tape or something and just try to kind of make it all look at least somewhat nice and tidy. I'm thinking I'll kind of, Maybe grab some Velcro or something and stick this right up here or just some two-sided tape. Have that stay there so I can actually reach the uh, end of that receiver with the controller all the time. And then just kind of try to try my best to hide all the rest of the cables so it's not super obvious with messy cords everywhere. Now I've got everything cleaned up at least somewhat well. It's obviously not perfect and you can see duct tape everywhere. But uh, that's besides the point. It looks a lot nicer than it did, at least in my opinion. So we've got the little receiver right here, Velcro it on, and then the little controller right here, Velcro it on. Although when you take this off, you kind of have to like tear it off and do a little of that. And I don't know where that just went. Give me one second. Yes, but this Velcro is, uh, it's super strong, but it doesn't want to stick to my car right here. Um, so yeah, that's just something to, to worry about there now. But that looks pretty good when it's right there. Everything in here, that looks pretty awful, but you can't really see that when you're sitting back here. So that's nice. Um, down on the side, let me show you here. So there's one light up here and then one light down here. So it's all worked in there nicely. And I just lifted up a piece of the trim and stuffed the uh, extra wiring down there. And then I can show you over on the other side here. 
We've got the same thing, although over here it's even cleaner because of just how I can work it in here. You can actually just lift up the trim there and then run the wire from that light all the way back here. And I did the same thing in there. Just stuffed all the wires in there. So it looks pretty clean now. And uh, yeah, now we just gotta wait till night and then we can actually see how these look when it's dark out. Now we can officially test how these lights look in the dark, as you can see, it's night now. I'm just leaving work right now, so we can turn it on for the first time in the dark. And if I can find it, wait, am I, I'm hitting the off button. Yo, check that out. <laughs> that looks so sick. That is awesome. It fills it out so nicely. Dude, this looks awesome. Okay, we've got, we've got different colors here. Okay, so this is just like plain white. Oh wait, that's, okay, blue. Yellow or green or something. Oh the, oh, the red looks nice. And I can adjust the brightness on here too. Actually, I can't really see the lights. Or the buttons, not lights. Dude, this looks sick. I like the red. That's just nice. And like the, uh, the blue one. Where's the blue? Yeah. Dude. I love this. Check that out. Even from like outside, that looks so sick. I absolutely love that. I wonder, can you like see it from outside? Not really, not really, okay. That's actually good. I was hoping it wouldn't like illuminate my entire face, but man, this looks sick. This looks really good. Man, I cannot get over how absolutely incredible these look. This is so sick. Like I said earlier, if you wanna pick some up for yourself, I'll put a link in the description below to where you can buy them. And uh, yeah, I guess that's all for this video. If you wanna see more videos about building up this Honda Civic on a budget, you can click right up here for a playlist about that. And if you wanna see another cool video from this channel, you can click right here for that, and I will see you over there.